Welcome back to Fallout New Way... Vegas? Vegas! Where the hell are we? We're not in Vegas, certainly. No, we are at the Mojave Drive-In. Far away from Vegas, because I went back in time. To, I think it was when, yeah, exactly when we dealt with the Omertas. Um... So I went back there because then we haven't, we have, sure we have angered some, but we haven't closed any doors per se exactly. And we're very decked out at this point, so it's good. So we're gonna go back and do some of the first quests uh, to gain strength and to be uh, the most powerful we can possibly be once the final battle comes because we had no chance of doing it, even... With my bullshit coward tactics, there was no chance. Okay, so let's see what this is. It's a satellite. Nothing happened since the midnight showing at the Mojave G hasn't started yet. Right. Uh, it starts at midnight, I'm assuming. That's very soon. Can we... No, oh. What? Right. Oh, I... I thought that was the clock. I'm an idiot. So let's see. We just have to wait them. We missed it. Oh, can wait a little longer. Come on. And there. It starts at midnight. Let's wait two hours. Or maybe the start just here. Oh. Is it a movie? Alright. The crash satellite seems to be the source of the strange transmission you received. I did receive a strange transmission? All world blues is recommended for experienced couriers. What? The fuck is this? You have a premonition that while you'll be unable to return to the Mojave until you solve the mystery of the big empty, you will be able to take on anything you care and you will... Old World Blues. Okay, wait, this is some sort of expansion then? Is this part of some kind of expansion pack? I don't get it. Let's see, let's quick save and let's see what it is. Take a closer look. Let's edit intensive. It is returned to Prim. Okay, so Eddie is at Prim. Now we know. What the fuck is this? All TV. Old World Blues. Okay, so I guess it's some kind of expansion-ish thing. In the years thing? before the what? Great War, Big Mountain had been the home to the brightest minds of the 21st century. I did not expect Scientists this. Scientists of vision were drawn to the facility to tackle the greatest technological challenges of the era. They sought to create a new world, fueled by technology, for the benefit of all mankind. Sounds a lot like the Sonic normal world. Editors, space age alloys, DNA hybridization, force field particle research, autodoc advances in cranial, cardiac, and trauma surgery. Yes. The hopes and dreams of a century became realities in the electronic forges of Big Mountain. Oh, is that what's called Black Mountain? Was the dome, a huge stone facility. Do we get to blow the dome? Every science known to man. It was a think tank where no problem could not be solved, where no question could not be answered. The Great War oh, God. brought new energy to Big Mountain and its scientists. Although a new energy? The, front lines, the scientists waged their own war, fighting their battles at the atomic level. The equations Danny DeVito's and calculations hike. marched endlessly across chalkboards and computer terminals toward one solution. Winning the war. For years... The oh, come on. The of Big Mountain were a blaze of trajectories, weapon schematics, and nuclear theories. Right. The problems began to outpace the solutions. First, geometrically. 
Not geometrically. Not exponentially. So did the questions. Not the questions. On the night of October 23rd, 2077, the scientists received an answer that put all their questions to rest. Okay, this is some good backstory, actually. Big Mountain silent experiments went to sleep. Experiments. Creators slowly dying in the new world that had been left behind. And the great Mount. stone in the middle of the big empty lay untouched, filled with countless technological. Oh, are we gonna go there? Wonders that, in the end, had been answers to the wrong question. Interesting. Ah, consider me intrigued. Okay, so I guess this will be useful for uh, leveling up and stuff. You feel strangely heavier. A quick inspection of your body is faint surgical scratch on your head, chest, and back. Welcome to the big empty. Thank you. But where the hell, like, on the map are we? Let's have a look. World map. All right. I guess this is its own world. Okay, so we I guess this will uh, lead us to the solution why the whole world was uh, bombed to smithereens. That should be a thing, probably. I uh, let's see. Uh, Let's see what happens here. Let's give it a shot at least. Because, uh, hey, oh, uh, this was all to gain experience anyway. Okay, so there's a lot of things here. Book shoot. So back up hollow tape to restore files. What is this? Sync sentry. So best hollow tape and sync doc. Okay, we need stuff to put in here, I suppose. Workbench. Can I? Oh, uh, yeah, let's recycle some stuff. Might as well. Cycle that and recycle. Flame refuel as well. Uh, yeah, that will do just fine. Uh, anything we can do here. All right, we can't do anything here as of yet. Uh, and we're supposed to go to here. I think... Tank or big empty requires key. Okay, so we can only go there. A strange feeling of pacifism comes over you, and you can't, you can't draw a weapon for some reason. For some reason, can't you just come up with a plausible plot element? All right, this is I odd. Pacification. Pacification field. Wow, that's a hard word. Oh, they are brains in there. Oh, a classic. Hey, breaking news, Klein. It wasn't me, all right? I'm the robotical engineer. Eight is sound waves. That's his specialty. You always do this. You always demean me. What the fuck? Guests. And it's not O, all right? It's enough. Either of you do it again. <laughs> it'll be the last time. Now. He seems now. perfectly insane. Now I forgot what I was saying. What was I talking about? Uh... Oh, God. Uh, are you the one who performed surgery on me? I was at the theater and I was here. What is this place? Yeah, but how are you all speaking through that one voice box? Yeah, let's ask that. Did it just say something? Anyone catch that? Moros, you work with animals. Translate. <laughs> it's here in the dome. Oh, as if this situation couldn't get any worse. Now we've got lobotomites. Yalla, lobotomites? It screets all over everything. 
What are you talking about? That's a good question. If my hypothesis is correct, this lobotomite is the repository of the brain we sent the signal to. The skin below once containing it. If so, it's proof that there may indeed be something beyond the crater. Just look at it. The way it blinks. It's like <laughs> a big hairless teddy bear. This is so fucking weird and odd. Is, I want to know why it's down here. With its, its limbs all over everything. <laughs> and are those penises I see wriggling on its feet? <laughs> Oh, this is fucking hilarious. Little teddy bear toes. Penises are much larger than those tiny extremities. Yeah, not that I would know. I don't recall a human penis ever being that large. It depends what am I supposed to comment on this? Look at its little nose with its two orifices for ingesting oxygen. Noses? By the great static, these lobotomites confound me with their sheer number of useless extremities. All right. Oh, oh, we okay, okay. P hold up one finger, point at itself. Point at them. Hold up five fingers. Let's try that. They like science. Holding up an array of fully erect <laughs> If it tries to insert them, activate vivisectors. <laughs> Oh, I fucking love this. I don't believe those gestures were random. Random at all. Following our conversation. Where the hell is this going to end? Understands us. I agree with Boros's histrionic findings. This the might is unusually attentive. I can't comprehend that. If we slow down our oral process of receptors to understand this excretion, we'll all be rendered ignorant. All of you, power down. Oh, come on. Prove once and for all how wrong you all are. As usual, Lobotomite, do you understand me? Was this Battlefield Earth? Uh, let's see then. <laughs> that would be brutal. Uh, yes, I'm guessing that crash channel satellite was yours. Those were words, weren't they? In the form of questions. He's asking me questions. Is this some kind of trick? The Our fuck? efforts have turned against us. <laughs> Thank God we created a monster. Perhaps as we were ruthlessly lobotomizing it with our cutters, we filled this skin below with awareness. <laughs> <laughs> with Wait, wow, they sure are insane. Us, can reason with us. Then this may be just the answer we've been looking for. Oh, this is gonna be a quest great quest giver, hopefully. Transmission from the Forbidden Zone coming right at us. Forbidden Zone? If it isn't my own colleagues, the mighty think tank of Big Mountain. Dr. Mobius? Oh. <laughs> it is I, Dr. Mobius, transmitting from my dome shaped <laughs> dome in <laughs> 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 Soon, all science will be mine. Oh, God, Robo Scorpions. So, cower in your think tank. Wait for the end. That's all. Goodbye. Oh, I fucking love this. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, Let's get speed. Oh, well, at some point we'll have to get speed up to the highest, anyways. So why the hell not now? Uh, Mobius, always the same 
podcast. <laughs> He's clearly mad, driven insane by his flawed and imprecise <laughs> kindergarten research methodology. What are we going to oh, do? Oh, wow. There's no way we can breach the Forbidden Zone. There's those robot scorpions everywhere. <laughs> the Forbidden Zone. Where no oh, I love this. They are so foreboding. And the technologies that could save us. They are oh, so we're gonna battle Robo Robo Scorpion. Did you see his cracked monitor? He's clearly let himself go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wonder if we'll ever be able to understand that. Ask for lobotomite for help. Hey, I think you need the fluid levels in your logic assist pumps checked. Oh, Yeah, totally. We scooped that out. We don't even know where we left it. None of us have the knowledge. What we're running out of without a brain? How the hell is this one gonna end? I'm so excited to find out. Uh, uh, you removed my brain? You removed your brain, yes. <laughs> so soft, barely wrinkled, yet so flush with knowledge and experience. Ooh, you're... <laughs> <and extraction. laughs> Thank God we didn't do this quest first, that would have been weird. I was assuming. Brainless perk. Your brain has been replaced with advanced technologies. Your hair can no longer be crippled. Wow. And it's resistant to chem addiction. 25 resistance. And shock from bodily damage. Wow. Awesome. We get to keep this? This is the best thing ever. If your brain was anywhere in the dome, why you could access your aggression centers. Circumventing the pacification field. This <laughs> no, no. We no, no. Fight. We do not want that. Reminds me of my days in American High and Richie Marcus. Medicine. Oh, crap. Heard all over. I'm a surgeon. Do you do to me? I feel like a badly put together jigsaw puzzle. That is my responsibility. Although in truth, the uh -huh. dog had done most of the work already. Quite industrious. Almost cut into all my investigations. Once <laughs> it had removed the brain and I misplaced it, other organs began to cry for direction, using your nerves as telegraph wires. Rather than let them send their signals. All right, come on. As well. Shh, little orc. <laughs> Go to sleep in your tanks. Dala loves you. First was the heart. Heartless break. The scars on your chest seems to confirm what the thing Thank is saying. You cannot be poisoned. Wow! And filters in your artificial blood pump will regulate bleeding and healing, allowing all healing items to function in higher level. Re robots are now confused by you and your fit percent likely to score a critical oh, Wow this are some goddamn the perks the was first. Third was <laughs> spine. Spineless perk due to your complications with the procedure your spine is being replaced as well. Your torso can no longer be crippled and your strength and damage stress have increased by one. Wow totally In getting stronger that this was the right choice to do. Oh, but we could have done this in the very fucking beginning as well, and have a huge advantage. You take out my brain, heart, and spine. You shake my brain, but what have you misplaced it with? The reason my hair, what the hell is it? You took out my brain, heart, and spine. Oh no, I accidentally. Oh. What? <laughs> They flushed down my brain. That is the sound of 
pushing. By the Fisher of Rolando, enough of this biological surgery talk. <laughs> oh, Listen to my voice. Oh, wow, this is amazing. We need your help. With the robot scorpions? With science? You said something about needing technology to stop Mobius first. You scoop my bed and now you want to save me? I'm not coming to help you. You said something about needing yes. technology. We want to help them, of course. Chance, a desperate plan that came to us after Mobius' first broadcast. Maybe, just maybe, if we reclaim these buried technologies, <laughs> we can put an end to Mobius and the horrors spawning from the Forbidden Zone. Let's complete the... Uh, this. What exactly is the plan? You're losing me in generalities. I need specifics. Yeah, let's do that. The plan is very complicated. We are still calculating how it would work if it succeeded. That is our part of the plan. <laughs> Why me? Can't you do it? Well, they can't. I'll help. What do you need from me? Excellent. This is turning out much better than the activate the retreat protocols and cower in my room idea. <laughs> Um, okay. <laughs> what? The research centers? Whoa! Nice. Right, right. Into your biological tired laziness and decide you would sweat too much carrying them. You have a new spine. Use it. Uh huh. Or will we keep this? There was something we didn't get to keep after exiting this. This whole planet this sounds dangerous. These divides sounds dangerous. What are these technologies? Uh, yeah, let's do that. The technologies are the X2 transmitter antenna array used to focus coherent thought at excessively high frequencies. <laughs> excessively high frequencies. A stealth suit, a suit like nothing this world has ever heard, seen, or could ever see. Uh huh. And eight sonic sound wave emitter projector gun. Able to broadcast sound at lethal frequencies. Oh, a sound gun. Also gives a great bio gel massage. <laughs> we have informed you of all we need. We estimate if you are focused, your time investment will be minimal <laughs> by our standards. If you work quickly, you will be the recipient of a gesture of gratitude from us. We do not bestow these old world gestures lightly. Oh, we're the show someone. Best I can get through this, the better. Trust me, I want to get over this as quickly as possible. Yeah, quickly as possible. Our intentions exactly. The important thing is you rush quickly through this task so as not to waste our time. Uh huh. Do not get curious, or you will end up like the cat of Schrödinger. <laughs> yeah, you would be tempted to explore Big Mountain Crater and examine the many amazing non-mandatory research labs oh, that go oh. off your designated path. Such optional explorations are discouraged. <laughs> All right. As if you have blinders on and leave curiosities and items of interest alone. So many sciences and developments <laughs> pass them by. Oh. The and the desire to simply finish, to end it all quickly and carelessly. Go We're gonna loot stuff. We're definitely gonna loot stuff. <laughs> oh, there will be plenty of time afterward to partake of the experiments once our bidding is done. Guess I better get walking then. Maybe I'll do a little exploring. I yeah, need don't need to say that to them. Ah, that is correct. You must walk upon your many penis feet. <laughs> much slower than our advanced hovering robotical frames. The 
little teddy bear <laughs> right into the pylon perimeter on its thick, turgid feet, returning it to us quickly and rectly, yeah, directly. <laughs> I fucking love this. Pylons. What pylons? Do we need to construct more of them, perhaps? Erectly. Get too close to the blinking posts, and the proximity warning shall be your warning. You are too close. Right. You get near it. Your vision will blur as the electrodes in your head shut off one by one. Click, click, click. Right, come on, then. We're running out of time. I guess that would do it. Oh, biologically, biology die. Such tiny inconveniences are less than the greater convenience and convenience. Yeah, come on. Oh, okay. Uh, 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 great. I don't want to hear any more about that. No, come on! What is it? The lobotomite is asking me things, oh, and I'm trying to ignore them. My processors <laughs> can't ignore you both at the same time. Oh, this. Well, you know how we asked it to fetch the sonic emitter thing? Turns out we already have it. What are the odds? <laughs> 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 high school science fair? Get your act together. You're making us look like a collection of round earthers. You're always yelling. My receptors can't take it anymore. And neither can my feelings. <laughs> oh, come on, how long is this? <laughs> yelling because you contaminated specimens can't keep your probes off the volume knob on my voice module. Uh, there's a weapon handy over all political use. Yeah. It's truly the end of all intelligence when the lobotomite speaks more wisdom than you geniuses. <laughs> so, if we have the sound wave, sonic projecto thing gun <laughs> and what in Heisenberg's name do we need from X8? Anyone? I believe we need <laughs> a new frequency embedded into the gun. Okay, needs a new frequency? Lost in X8 just as X8 is forever lost to us. The sadness of my high school days. The <laughs> sadness of my youth. My youth lost. <laughs> oh really, Boros? All you did in high school was call me Fink Tattletail and all the kids you hated, you little teacher's pet brown hound. Give <laughs> the lobotomite the emitter. Does he have the frequency loaded? Oh, I don't think so. Wait. What is he doing? I think he's Sanjak. Getting warmed up. You give it to the lobotomite. I'm not to oh, see that thing. I'll do it Come on. Sonic sterilization. <laughs> All antibacterial fresh. Here, oh. little teddy bear. I have thrown oh all rub coat terminating codes view from the device. It is good and ready for your hands. <laughs> all right. No! What did you do that? Fuck! What were you saying about the? F That's pretty cool. This little sunway thing on Careful my back. Where you're pointing that? That device wasn't always a weapon. It was more oh. like a force field. Thing once. Forward, back. Oh, come on! Especially this sign. Find the comma. Uh. Oh, come on! You can disable force fields. Yeah. Maybe. Not currently. Okay. A Boris. All right. Uh, so I need to stop moving. Okay, I need to do. That. So, yes. Get these things for us. Right, come on. I'll head out to come back with these well, things. Good. Thank you. Yes, thank you. Wait. Is it oh, come on.
Come on! Oh, oh, this is getting way too long. Might be more comforting for it to hang out with its spine and heart. Okay. Putting that along. Come on. Reinstall the sh some kind of ship. Oh, come on. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, the sink. Okay, good, good, good. Uh, oh, I can try the other need something. Activate function. Uh, yeah, okay. I cannot dispute your logic. Uh, things. Come on. Okay, now it, this it's quite enough of this. All right. Uh, so connection. Just blood circumference thing upstairs. Come on. Enough. Oh, thank you. Thank God. Okay, I'll see you next <laughs> time.